So we're going to use the AMD Lasers Picasso Light, which is a diode laser. Get an uninitiated tip. I have it set for 0.5 watts continuous wave. Now, Erica, you're going to feel this a little bit. As you feel it or it gets too uncomfortable, just raise your hand and I'll look at it at the periphery of my eye okay. to see that and then I'll pull back. Okay. So our goal is typically I start about 10 millimeters away. Okay? Mm -hmm. Do you feel that much? Heat. And you're going to feel heat. Going back and forth, getting as close as I can without it being too uncomfortable for her. Again, I do not use anesthetic because I want her to give me the feedback of when she feels it. You okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's 30 seconds. Now I'm going to bump it up an additional watt. Now I'm at 0.6. You okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, again. Let me know if it gets too uncomfortable. Again, if I can touch the lesion it, itself, I will. My goal is to get as close as possible without it being too uncomfortable for her. Okay, how you doing? Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to bump it up again another watt. I'm at 0.7. Do you feel that much? Mm-hmm. You okay? So anywhere where I actually have open lesion, you'll see the kind of pinkish, whitish color of the lesion become almost straw color, slightly brown. Okay, again, let me know. You okay? Mm-hmm. You feel that much? Mm. A little bit? Mm-hmm. You okay, though? Mm-hmm. So I'm actually able now to touch the lesion where I couldn't initially. You okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. How are we doing? Good. Okay. Let's bump it up another. Tenth of a watt, so we're 0.8 watts. So we started at 0.5. I think I might have said we bump it up a watt per interval. It's a tenth of a watt. So we started at 0.5. Now we're at 0.8. You okay? Mm -hmm. You feel that a little bit more? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Let's bump it up another tenth of a watt. You okay? Mm-hmm. Do you feel that much? Hot. So our sensation is of warmth or heat, which I would expect. Okay. All right, Erica, we're done. So it took us actually <clears throat> five different intervals. And before when I touched it, it was very, very painful. Do you feel that at all now? No. Yeah. Okay, good, good. So it's, it's not going to instantly look better, but what you're going to see, it's going to heal much faster than it would in the past, and it's going to be much less sensitive for you. 
So you saw how easy that was using the diode laser. Again, I used AMD lasers, Picasso light for this procedure. It's a diode laser, a soft tissue laser. This is such a great service for our patients. You know, some of our patients may experience an alpha ulcer, you know, if they spend too much in the sun or even the time of the month, whatever it is. And I've even had patients that have canceled their dental visit because of a soreness on the lip or inside the mouth and they were afraid that I might injure them further by doing dentistry. So hopefully this helps you provide another service, another great service for your patient utilizing technology and utilizing the diode laser.